actually, I would argue that the UK has followed a similar strategy to Sweden because uh, the idea was never to contain infection or the pandemic or maximal suppression of infection. The aim was always to keep hospitals at or just below capacity, with capacity being defined as as long as we don't have oxygen shortages and we have beds for people who need urgent care, it's fine. And that unfortunately meant that we were happy with uh, hospitalizations rising to about 4,000 per day, which is very considerable, and our uh, critical care being absolutely full to the point that people had to prioritize who to give a ventilator to and who to deny ventilation to. And, you know, that is in some ways not very different from a herd immunity strategy because um, there is no, it, it kind of says that transmission doesn't matter as long as hospitals aren't overwhelmed which is really concerning. And that's exactly why the UK ended up in a situation where it acted so late that it had over 80,000 deaths related to the second wave and over 150,000 deaths from COVID in total. And I think that's what Sweden has also done. It's consistently not had uh, adequate measures to contain transmission and has always acted at a point in time where it was inevitable and had to act to essentially prevent healthcare systems being overwhelmed. So I think the UK strategy is quite similar to Sweden. What's changed now is we have a high level of vaccination in the UK, which means that the government considers that we can let transmission get much, much higher than we've had at any point before, because once again, the focus was never transmission. It, it means that you know, obviously, given our hospitalization rate is now about six times lower than it would have been without vaccinations, we can now let cases get sixfold higher than they were before, before we lead to hospitals getting overwhelmed. And I think that's what vaccination has meant for government. It hasn't meant containing transmission. It has meant that they can allow cases to get much higher before they act.